that you know who we are, I would like to explain what we're currently working on. Now, as I mentioned in our introductory video, Church Genes was created to develop technical tools and training to help churches collaborate more effectively. Now, these tools will start with our new Church Geographic Information System that will combine the benefits of geospatial mapping and social networking. This web-based free system will give churches around your town, your country, and eventually around the world the opportunity to connect, collaborate, and cultivate for the glory of God. So what is geospatial mapping and how can it help to save the lost? Well, geographic information systems allow a user to access a variety of information and have it presented visually on a map. This data gets layered into data sets which can be turned off and on by the user. Think about it this way, you probably already use Google Maps. With Google Maps, you can bring up a location and then add other types of information onto the base map. So if you're in Medford, Oregon and want to find a local restaurant, you bring up the local map online, query restaurants, add that information onto the map, and you can see the location of various eateries. You then click on a particular restaurant to visit their website and learn even more. Well, our tool will use the same concept, with, but with different data sets. We'll combine a comprehensive church database and then layer that with other types of information. We combine this geospatial map modeling with a social networking component. Think about combining Google Maps with Facebook. This is necessary because our users will be able to add searchable visual data sets of their own. This is where the social networking component comes in. Churches or individuals would be able to create two additional types of data sets, groups and campaigns. A group could be a local Christian singles group, a worldwide group of concerned Christians sharing strategies for sustainable farming, or a denominational group that allows Baptists all over the world to have a common forum for sharing, planning, and connecting. Another category of user-created uh, data set would be a campaign. This would allow a group of churches in an area to work on a common problem. So perhaps you have a large number of churches in Baltimore who want to get together to work to combat homelessness. This site will allow these users to coordinate efforts, share ideas, pull resources, strategize, and visually track campaign results. And this doesn't have to be localized. A church that works with missions in numerous countries would have a way to track the results, find new ways to help, and stay connected with their missionary. The uses are practically innumerable. Now all of this data gets layered onto a map along with research data related to poverty or sexual violence or any other quantifiable research, allowing anyone to see the work that is being done, find ways to get involved, or contribute time, money, or resources. Because what we're trying to create here is more than a useful website. We want to create a movement. We believe that the church can and will do more in this world when we start communicating better, working more deliberately in our various missions, and are able to strategically map out our strategy. When we all begin to realize that we're part of one body that covers the globe, a body that has many parts but is united in purpose and powered by the creator of the universe. Thank you.